are 14, where this weekend we are in Daytona at Daytona Beach International Raceway. Um, and we are going to be uh, driving our 26 as usual. Um, let me throw a setup on the car really fast. Uh, we are using a, a car setup by uh, Delta Force Racing. One thing is for sure, I did not do anything to do with suspension or any of the ride heights or anything. Those were all wrong. Uh, it just, yeah, you get speed out of the car, but the car looks retarded, bottoming out everywhere around the track. So with that said, we didn't do that. Uh, and it's a play track. Really, all you can do is just wedge uh, your biases uh, and in tire pressure, really, that's it. So we're running 35s on the left and 45s on the right in the tires. Uh, that's just my personal preference. Um, and we're running 14% on the steering. We're gonna qualify, so we end up. We were fast in practice, able to run with the cars in the draft. Uh, so I'm pretty confident in the car, being able to uh, get out here and, and get a decent spot. Um, possibly a pull uh, with the with the lap times I was running with the leaders. So we'll see what um, we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, 14% on the steering. Uh, it took a while to dial that in. Um, anything underneath that was just too dead or anything too above it was too twitchy. The problem is in the draft, the car gets a little dancy and uh, you got to deal with that. But you know, that's what you got to do. So we're gonna do that. Uh, you're wondering why it's daytime and not nighttime. Um, since it is the Coke 0400, the Coca-Cola 600 and 400s and all that good stuff, we have always been shot at, or sorry, the Coke 0400 is shot at night, raced at night, not shot, but raced at night. Um, and they had a lot of rain over the weekend, so there was rain delays. And they ended up getting the race in on Sunday morning. Um, and they ended up being under caution. Under caution, they ended up uh, finishing half of the race. Uh, so Eric Almirola won. Um, Kurt Busch ran the most laps, uh, led, the, led the most laps and uh, finished third, so it wasn't bad for that team, but uh, they deserved the first place finish, uh, even if it was under rain. So that was kind of sucky, but it was amazing race, and uh, there was huge, two huge crashes. You know, that's just restricted plate racing. You're side by side, and it takes one mistake, and then everybody else pays for it, especially in the front. Uh, Greg Biffle wrecked uh, right in the back end of Casey Kane, hit him a couple times and spun him eventually. All right, let's just go. Uh, we, we wound the car up on the top lap. The final lap here, we're gonna just, I need to stop talking and drive the car. Uh, we need to get down here on the yellow. The thing with this uh, setup is the car wants to suck down onto the apron a lot, uh, which is fine, it likes to hit the yellow. But during a race, that can be detrimental. Uh, we don't need to get next to the wall because we're qualifying. Just, we're not gonna go any faster next to the wall than we are in the middle of the track. Um, but to uh, reiterate uh, my point there, yeah, the, in qualifying or running on the bottom line. Now, yes, we'll have to run the bottom line if we have to in the race. I mean, you can't just immediately run the high line, but we will be running the high line. Uh, that just, the, the car just seems much better up there. And uh, the AI love to run up there too. So that's probably what's gonna happen. Woo, look at that. We caught the pole. I like that already. We need uh, a better weekend than uh, last weekend, uh, which we did fight back and, and came back and finished uh, 15th or 4th. Uh, I forget what it was. 14th, 15th. We started 14th and then 15th, I believe is what it was. Uh, but either way, you know. Alrighty, let's get, uh, uh, let's go ahead and begin. Before I begin the race, I'm going to tell you guys, I am recording to an external drive, um, not my regular drive. The PC is just, it's, this has been, this has been a joke. I mean, it's, it's back and forth. Uh, sometimes it wants to work. Uh, sometimes the, everything, it's, it's just bad. It's just bad. And, um, I've got to thank every single one of you that have donated towards the PC. We met our goal and uh, going to be getting a new PC very soon. So I'm very excited about that. Um, so look forward to a v upcoming vlog uh, to uh, show that and uh, what you guys help pay for and all that good stuff uh, for those of you that donated. And um, that's all I wanted to say real quick. Let's get out there and let's do some racing. Alrighty, starting the inside of Kenseth here on the pole position. All right, we're going to... Go easy here, try to get our start nice and good. There we go, don't spin those tires. Uh, we are running COGB on the transmission, so that's another adjustment that we did. I'm not blocking. If I turn this button on, you guys tell me, that shows their their name, it seems like they want to draft with me. 
If I have that off, it's like they don't want to do it. I, I don't know if that's just me thinking that or if it's a true thing, but... Another thing of this track, I will tell you guys, you know how uh, these Gen 6 cars and the setups just by themselves, they love to jot hard to the right when you let out of the gas. Uh, so this is a track you got to drag the brake on quite a bit. So it's a lot of left, left foot work here. That's for sure. And see, if I have the button on, they seem like they don't want to drive around me. They want to stay in line with me. So I'm going to just I'll stick with what works. If it's working, it's working. Come on, Tony. You don't want to drop down. You're a piece of shit. Come on. All right. They're going to drive down the inside of us. We should be able to catch that draft off Tony. I don't trust Menard for good reason. Boy, you are all over the road, buddy. Keep it low. Keep it low. Oh, fucking Austin Dillon's behind me. He's been my, my rival for the last three races. We got a hell of a run here, though, Gordon. Let's do it. Let's do it, buddy. I'm into the break, but go down. Go down. I'm going to recycle the button. Maybe they'll, maybe they'll come down. There we go. I don't know why that works. It could be coincidence, but you guys will probably tell me. I don't have that proximity radar on, so I can't see if a car's blue or whatever. If I'm actually hooking up with him and running with him, they won't tell me. Yeah, I'm watching it. Man, Dylan, you are about to get somebody killed. Gordon, I... What the hell are you doing? They are squirrely as shit, aren't they? I really don't... Like I said in uh, qualifying, I didn't want to be on the bottom line if I didn't have to, but... We have had no choice so far. Wow, what a run we got there. That inside line was fast. Yep, I'm gonna push Biffle. Just like he did Casey Kane on Sunday. Only it wrecked him. <laughs> there we go, I like that. Yep, gotta be patient here. That's what it's all about. Edwards is not gonna be patient. We got the high line, but wow, did Clint Boyer check up. That whole high line did. Got to really watch here. I'm going to turn that off. It looks stupid with the names. But if I want somebody to push with me, I'll uh, I'll just hit the button. Sometimes I flick it. It seems to work. I don't know. Let's just watch it here. Man, these guys are running close, aren't they? Woo! Coming up on Austin Dillon, watch out for the safer barrier wall. Man, they're nuts here. Come on. Dillon, you're fucking our race up up there, you piece of shit. You're going so damn slow on the high line, you're fucking us. In the back, we have to check up so much. The whole line, yeah, he's gonna wreck somebody. Let's just get around him. He's slow as shit. We'll go three wide. I mean, we gotta do what we gotta do. You're a dick. Dylan, you're a dick and a half. Wow, I don't know how we didn't wreck there. He, he nearly tried to kill us. He's probably pissed from Kentucky, but come on, guys. I'm hardened to the brakes there the best I can be. Whew, man, this is nerve-wracking as shit. That bottom line cannot be materializing that quick, is it? Seems like it is. Yeah, we're watching that in shot line. I don't like that. That was a reword. Yeah, well, they're bumping the shit out of us right now. They're being assholes. Hit the button and see what happens there. All right. Looks like he's going to stay in line for now. Man, this is ridiculous. Especially coming off of the turn two. Off turn two, this high line is, is slowing. And the straights were, were slower, too. If we can get on the bottom line, we need... I don't know. The, the top's yeah. starting to work a little bit better here. A little bit better. Not by much. Temps are good. Water temp looks good. And the draft are running about 195, 200. Jeez, you guys are fucking checking up so fucking hard on the high line. We're going to go three wide. We're going to have to. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. I knew it was going to happen, you biffle. You motherfucker. Hold the brakes. You're a son of a bitch. I don't know what happened there. They didn't even give us a good angle. Didn't even give us a good angle. That's the end of our day. You piece of shit.
Yeah, no, we're pitting. Of course we're going to pit. Fix the damage. Nothing else. What an asshole. Well, we can try to fight back. We got a few laps to do it, but wow. Wow, wow, wow. That's restricted plate racing, though. Okay, I want you guys to repair the car. Yes. No fuel. None. No tires. Tires, none. Uh, okay. Yep. Yeah. Anything else? We're just repairing the car. No tires. I said no tires, but okay, cool. I think it's just part of the animation. I don't think they're actually putting tires on there. That's totes legit, I know. And look at that. They just drive around us. Even though they got tires, I bet. We don't need tires. Whatever. Yeah, so you guys telling me, I don't know. I don't know what we did wrong there. I mean, it's just all over the place in the draft. Awesome job, guys. Just restricted play racing. Boy, thanks for the damage repair there, guys. Assholes. Oh, if I fucking see you, buddy. I'm gonna remember that. Come on, guys, go. There we go. We got a lot of work to do now to try to get a decent finish today. A lot of work. We got that damage. It's gonna hurt us aerodynamically. I'm gonna pull away like that. That's awesome. I thought we would be able to run in the draft even with a damaged car. I guess not. Unbelievable. Look at this shit. Ruined our day. And we we're barely, barely hanging on to that draft. Nothing. Just nothing. They just drove away from us. What a joke. Not happy about this weekend. At all. at all but maybe they'll start dropping back if they start dropping back we can catch draft i'm hoping on off of larson's the only way we're going to get it but and that highline was checking up so fucking much i don't know why they were it was austin dillon was in the front leading that top line and he just screwed all of us by just checking up so much on the high line so i don't know we're toast Day's over with for us. Keep pushing, you gain a couple tenths on the car in front. Well, it's the only shot we have is we gotta run with uh Larson. And we're gonna have to push him really hard. Cause he's losing the draft too. Come on, let's do this. Come on, man. We're gonna have to tandem draft. Real realistic, I know. Let's do this, buddy. Push you, and here comes the bump draft, buddy. Yeah, well, that was easy enough, wasn't it? Whenever I'm drafting with him. We both have crappy cars. You can hear them not running so well. Bump drafting you the best I can here, buddy. Pushing the hell out of him, too. No, our day's done, dude. There's no way we can catch him. No fucking way. Greg Biffle ruined our day. Look at this. God, come on, game. Give me something here. You can't do it, can you? This is fun driving by ourselves out here on the track. I was having fun driving decently. No, doesn't matter. Give me a track we can race at, not a restricted plate. Over it. To go. Unbelievable. It's just unbelievable that we have no like wheel damage or anything. Like this is just aero damage and this is the difference. The leader is six seconds ahead. I'm literally driving this with one hand. 
because there's just nothing to do. We'll never catch the draft. Larson's way behind us. That's it. Well, there you have that. There you have that. Well, we could talk about a little bit about the PC since we're uh, out here just driving around. Um, it's going to be a AMD uh, core processor, 83, an FX 8320, which is uh, being donated by a per by one of our um, one of our uh, subscribers. And uh, we've, the case is a Cooler Master Stormtrooper. Um, Corsair, 16 gigabyte of RAM. Uh, it's an MSI motherboard. I don't know the exact model, but it is AM3 or whatever they call that. I'm not sure. All your normal high-end stuff. Um, it's going to be water-cooled, just a Corsair water-cooling kit um, for the CPU. 1,000-watt uh, EVGA uh, PSU. Uh, let's think about the G oh, the GPU is going to be a GTX, an EVGA GTX 660. And that's really about it. I can't think of anything else off the top of my head. Two, uh, two different. So it'd be a terabyte Barracuda, and then another one. So two terabytes, but separate drives for one to record to and one to have uh, the OS and all that good stuff on. And I'll probably end up putting FSX on the second one, or I might get a third drive and just put it on there. Oh yeah, I know it's nine seconds. It doesn't matter. Our day's done. We got screwed. And, and and that's another thing about this AI. I don't get why they body. They'll just like come out of nowhere and just slam you all the way up into the wall. And you just saw a squirrely they were driving all day. And I already know people are going to be like, you did this wrong and this wrong. And you were, you were all over the place. Yeah, well, that's why I always tell people, you do it. You do it. You drive this with a wheel. And you adjust the AI for that reason, that we're not using a controller or anything, and then you record it and you show me what you end up, because that's what I want to see. That's what I want to see. This sucks right here. Nothing sucks worse than this. Yeah, 10 seconds ahead, great for them. Why does Stenhouse Jr., he's leading, well good for him, but why does it constantly marquee like that? Oh. His uh, girlfriend, Anna Kilpatrick, just took the lead. If she wins this race, boy, that'll be something else, won't it? Danica wins, and I end up... Look at that, Greg Biffle. First. That's where I should have been, you dick. That's where I should have been. We had a car for it. We did lead today. Just, that's the thing. That's just restricted plate racing. I mean, you're so close to each other, you just don't. Uh, there's no escaping it. No escaping it at all. So I figured it was a crapshoot. It's always a 50 50 chance. I mean, there wasn't a big wreck or anything, but well, we got two cars off the pace here. They lost the draft, too. Maybe. I don't know. We did the best we could. We did the best we could. Yeah, and I had the uh, I had this game fatally crash on me twice today. What else? Oh, the graphics driver crashed a couple times. Ruined the recording. Uh, the original recording. So I had to re-record it. Uh, I had to find out. Had to, it wasn't recording to the, the hard drive correctly, so I restarted the PC and then got it to start recording. It's a lower frame rate. Like right now I'm getting 26, but in the draft we're getting like 20. I think it's terrible. So I'm very, very, very excited about getting the uh, the new graphics card. Sounds like I have a little bit too much trouble. I'm not sure. In the microphone, it seems like it, I heard a little bit of trouble popping out of there. So yeah, some of you guys that showed up for the uh, for the live stream, appreciate that. It was amazing. Had a good time with uh, Zach uh, and you guys as well. They got to play with us. Bugs wasn't able to join us. He's been having internet issues. And I saw earlier today, so I was like, oh, get Fios, don't use Comcast. Oh, I turned that down a little too much. Uh, use Fios, don't get Comcast. 
He doesn't have a choice. Comcast is all he has available to him. I believe it's is what it is at his uh, apartment complex. Yep, riding it out. Well, sorry guys, this was shitty. Shitty Bo Bitty. Now, I was, I've been thinking about in this series to uh, just start racing on the inside view. This is something different. Um, and I tried that and got half the frame rate, so that wasn't happening. Don't ask me why. So let's we'll be sticking to roof cam. So not only do you guys enjoy roof cam, but uh, I was gonna just try to change it up and have an inside view race, and I can't even do that. Just don't get the frame rate for it. Really looking forward to a new PC once I have that. This quality is just gonna rise so much. Oh, look at that, AG Alma Digger one. Good for him. Good for him. That's gonna do it for us. 20, or not 20, fucking 40 second. Unbelievable. Could we have restarted the race? Yeah, we could have, but we didn't do it. It happened. What happened, happened. So, and that's bullshit. They, oh, why are you feedback in you piece of shit? I'm turning the trouble down a little bit. Oh my Lord. Okay, guys, that's going to do it for us. 40 second. We move on, put our head down. Uh, I think in a couple of weeks we get, uh, we have Watkins Glen coming up. So we'll be practicing for that. Uh, if you guys enjoy the series, hit the like button. And uh, once again, thanks for uh, watching the video and see you guys next time.